Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, welcome to this brand new video. In my previous video, I talked about the causes of eye twitching. If you have not seen that video, I've put it in a playlist up here in this video, please watch that video, so that you will know the root cause of your twitching, before actually knowing how to treat and prevent it, which I will talk about in this video. Please watch this video to the end, so that you will be able to understand everything and how to treat and prevent your eye from twitching. Also, there is a bonus treatment method, which I will talk about at the end of this video. So you have to watch this video to the end to catch that. What is eye twitching? An eye twitch is an involuntary, abnormal blinking of your eyelid. This abnormal blinking may happen many times per day. If eye twitching is severe, it can affect your vision. One facial muscle closes your eyelid. Another raises your eyelid. Problems with either of these muscles, and sometimes both, may cause your eye to twitch. Other eye muscles also may contribute to eye twitching. Many people have an occasional eye twitch, especially when they are tired or have had a lot of caffeine. Frequent eye twitching is fairly uncommon. Anyone can have eye twitching, but it is more common in middle-aged and older women. Types of eye twitching Eyelid twitching can be classified into three types. Which are 1. General eyelid spasm 2. Essential blepharospasm 3. Hemifacial spasm Now let's talk about these three types in detail. General eyelid spasm Some amount of eyelid spasms can be considered typical and doesn't indicate any kind of serious problem. These twitches can arise from a variety of environmental factors, and generally disappear with rest. If these twitches are persistent and disrupt your life, you may want to speak with your doctor about your symptoms. Benign Essential Blepharospasm If the spasms become chronic, long-term, you may have what's known as benign essential blepharospasm, which is the name for chronic and uncontrollable winking or blinking. This condition typically affects both eyes and is more common in women than in men. It affects up to 50,000 people in the United States, and usually develops in middle to late adulthood. The condition will likely worsen over time, and as a result, it may eventually cause blurry vision, increased sensitivity to light, and facial spasms. Hemifacial spasm If the eyelid twitch affects just one eye, a hemifacial spasm is a possibility. This type of spasm is a neuromuscular disorder usually caused by a blood vessel putting excess pressure on one of your facial nerves. This disorder is more common in women than in men, and it's also more common in people from Asia, this doesn't mean it won't affect people from the United States or the UK if left untreated, it may cause the following. Frequent, uncontrollable eye twitching. An inability to open your eye, which is definitely not a good experience for anyone. Twitching in all muscles of one side of your face. Treatments of eye twitching. Most eyelid spasms go away without treatment in a few days or weeks. If they don't go away, you can try to eliminate or decrease potential causes. To treat eye twitching, you might want to try the following processes. Which are 1. Taking eye supplements 2. Drinking less caffeine 3. Getting adequate sleep 4. Keeping your eye surfaces lubricated with eye drops 5. Applying a warm compress to your eyes when a spasm begins if your doctor determines that intervention is needed, they may recommend antibiotics, surgery, or a variety of other treatment options depending on the exact cause. How can you prevent eye twitching? If your eyelid spasms are happening more frequently, try keeping a journal, and noting when they occur. Note your intake of caffeine, tobacco, and alcohol, as well as your level of stress, and how much sleep you've been getting in the periods leading up to, and during the eyelid twitching. If you notice that you have more spasms when you aren't getting enough sleep, try going to bed 30 minutes to an hour earlier, to help ease the strain on your eyelids, and reduce your spasms. Twitching related to stress, lack of sleep, and other lifestyle factors, have the best outlook. If an underlying health condition is the cause, then treating the underlying condition is the best way to relieve the twitching. Alright guys, here is what you have been waiting for, the bonus tip. Many people disregard the use of eye supplements for eye treatments. 
eye supplements are one of the most effective and trusted means of taking care of your eye problems. I have several testimonies from people who have tried using these eye supplements and it has helped them solve their eye related problems. For those who have not tried eye supplements for your eye care, here is your chance. Join the many thousands who have tried these supplements and it has worked for them. I have left the link to this kind of supplement in the description box of this video. If you're interested, you can try it out. Was this video helpful? If yes, give this video a like, subscribe to this channel, and hit the bell icon, so you won't miss out on eye care videos like this. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video.